Forget everything you thought you knew about transmissions. For decades, we've been stuck with the same basic designs, clunky manuals, sluggish automatics, and those pesky CVTs. But what if there was a transmission that offered the best of all worlds, the efficiency of gears, the smoothness of a CVT, and none of the drawbacks? Today, we're uncovering the secrets of the Ratio Zero Geared CVT, a groundbreaking invention poised to revolutionize power transfer. This isn't just an incremental improvement, it's a complete rethink born from the mind of visionary mechanical and automation engineer Edison Pavilku and brought to life by the innovative team Alter Ego Hardware, an Italian company. Transmissions are essential components that transfer power from the engine to the wheels. Manual transmissions are highly efficient, 95-98%, to 98 but offer step gear changes, leading to power delivery gaps. CVDs offer smooth, stepless gear changes and can improve engine efficiency by allowing it to operate at its optimal RPM. However, traditional CVTs, which use a friction belt between variable diameter pulleys, have some significant drawbacks. They typically have lower mechanical efficiency, 70 to 86 percent, due to belt slippage, which also creates the common rubber band effect where engine RPMs rise without a proportional increase in speed. This slippage generates heat, wasting energy, and requiring periodic belt replacements, increasing maintenance costs. Furthermore, high-torque applications can stress the belt, limiting their use in larger or performance vehicles. They also lack the engine braking of gear transmissions, which can be a safety concern in certain situations. Finally, some drivers simply prefer the more engaging feel of shifting gears. Efficiency in transmission systems isn't just about fuel economy or power delivery. It's also about sustainability and adaptability to modern automotive trends. With a growing emphasis on reducing emissions and increasing the viability of electric vehicles, transmission efficiency plays a pivotal role. For electric vehicles, where every bit of saved energy extends the range, a more efficient system like Ratio Zero could be a game changer. Furthermore, as hybrid systems and EVs often rely on their transmission to manage power delivery from multiple sources, the versatility and durability of a geared CVT could offer manufacturers new ways to optimize drivetrain performance while keeping maintenance costs low. So, while CVDs offer certain advantages, these drawbacks have limited their widespread adoption in certain vehicle segments. This is where the Ratio Zero comes in. It's described as a geared CVT, meaning it uses gears instead of belts or chains to vary the gear ratio. This is the key difference, and it aims to address many of the shortcomings of traditional CVTs. It's not a hybrid between a conventional CVT and a traditional gear transmission in the sense of having both present and switching between them. It's a CVT that uses gears as its core mechanism. Alter Ego claims this new mechanism is about 10% more efficient than regular belted CVTs and can even rival some manual transmissions in efficiency. If you're enjoying this video, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe for more content. Now, let's continue. Instead of belts and pulleys, the Ratio Zero utilizes a complex system of three internal gears mounted on curved arms. These arms are connected to free-spinning axles within planetary gear sets. By offsetting these axles, the arms articulate, creating what's described as a torque relay to the output ring gear. This intricate interplay of interconnected gears and arms smoothly alters their relationship with the output gear, resulting in a continuously variable transmission ratio. This precisely engineered mechanism is akin to a mechanical ballet. Crucially, this gear-based design directly addresses a key inadequacy of traditional CVTs, their inability to handle high torque loads. The Ratio Zero, by using gears to transmit power, can handle much higher torque loads, making it suitable for a wider range of vehicles and applications. The name Ratio Zero comes from a key design feature, the ability to achieve a zero to one ratio. This means the input shaft can rotate while the output shaft remains completely stationary, effectively creating a zero output and eliminating the need for a clutch to bring the vehicle to a halt. To further refine output smoothness, the design incorporates elliptical gears. It also allows for smooth gear ratio adjustments from zero all the way to overdrive, regardless of whether the wheels or crank are moving. This is significant because transmissions are designed to optimize drive system operation by constantly adjusting the gear ratio between the drive system and the wheels. The overall design is complex, but its purpose is to provide the seamless ratio changes characteristic of a CVT while leveraging the efficiency and robustness of gears. 
For a more detailed visual explanation of this complex mechanism, we highly recommend the Driving 4 Answers channel on YouTube. They have a fantastic video that breaks down the ratio zero in detail. We'll include a link in the description below. It's important to emphasize that these are potential benefits, as the Ratio Zero technology is still under development and widespread independent testing is limited. By employing gears instead of belts or chains, the Ratio Zero aims to minimize energy loss compared to traditional CVTs. This could translate to improved fuel economy in conventional vehicles or increased efficiency and range in electric vehicles. A key advantage of gears is their inherent ability to handle high torque. Consequently, the Ratio Zero's geared design has the potential to overcome the torque limitations of traditional CVTs, making it potentially suitable for a broader range of vehicles, including trucks and SUVs. The use of gears also suggests increased durability compared to belt or chain-based CVTs, as gears are generally more robust. However, the complexity of the Ratio Zero system necessitates extensive testing to validate its long-term reliability. The rubber band effect, often associated with traditional CVTs, is expected to be significantly reduced or eliminated in the ratio zero due to the more direct mechanical connection provided by gears. This could result in a more responsive and linear driving experience. The innovative design of the Ratio Zero also presents exciting possibilities beyond traditional automotive applications. Its inherent capacity for high torque handling and seamless ratio adjustments could prove invaluable in diverse fields such as industrial machinery, robotics, and even renewable energy systems like wind turbines, where precise variable speed control is paramount. By addressing the efficiency and durability shortcomings of conventional CVDs, this technology has the potential to become a cornerstone in industries demanding precise and reliable power management. It's crucial to emphasize that the Ratio Zero remains in the prototype and development phase. It is not currently implemented in any production vehicles by major manufacturers. Alter Ego Hardware, the company developing the Ratio Zero, has constructed a prototype integrated into a bicycle rear hub, which is currently undergoing testing on a Trek hybrid bike to demonstrate the technology's core principles. Future development plans include testing on various vehicles and pursuing partnerships with automotive manufacturers. Key challenges that remain include refining torque delivery, minimizing noise, ensuring long-term reliability, and mitigating potential mechanical stresses at the zero ratio. Alter Ego Hardware is seeking funding to support further research and development efforts. The Ratio Zero concept is intriguing. If it can deliver on its promises of efficiency, torque handling, and durability, it could have a significant impact on transmission technology. It's important to remember that significant hurdles remain, including rigorous testing, manufacturing scalability, and cost. It's also important to avoid overstating the current state of the technology. What are your thoughts on the Ratio Zero? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more automotive content. Thanks for watching.